a famous, controversial, and often misunderstood theory. Let me introduce you to the string theory of the universe, the theory that eluded Einstein. Here it is. Every material in the universe is made of atoms. For instance, if we look closer at an orange, we find out that orange is made of molecules. Molecules are made of atoms. Atoms are made of electrons, neutrons, and protons. If we zoom out to the nucleus, we see particles of protons and neutrons. But if we zoom even deeper into them, we see quarks. Quarks are the smallest known particle, and scientists believe that this is where it stops. But the string theory suggests something else. The string theory says that if you magnify the particles known as quarks, you will find a little tiny filament of energy, a little string that vibrates. Simply explained, the conventional ideal says there is nothing in the quark. But string theory says that there is something in quark, a vibrating string. Basically, string theory says that every material in space is made of little vibrating strings. So why don't we just look at what is inside the quark and confirm or deny this theory? Well, if we want to see something in a microscope, we need light and an eye. The problem is that the electromagnetic waves sent from a telescope are way too big to touch such as small particles such as quarks. Visible light just passes over them. So, why don't we just create electromagnetic waves with more and much smaller wavelengths? In quantum physics, more wavelengths mean more energy. So when we touch a particle with more energy, the particle will be kicked and the waves will never reach it. So we won't see it either. This problem or important fact is known as the Heisenberg Uncertainty Principle. It states that there is a limit to the precision with which certain pairs of physical properties, such as position and momentum, can be simultaneously known. String theory describes many different elementary particles as different modes of vibration of the string. Just like a violin string vibrating differently can give you a lot of notes. After string theory gained prominence in the late 1970s, its popularity among theoretical physicists fluctuated and the theory quickly graduated to a possible theory of everything. We don't yet know the true story of reality, so string theory could be right. However, the story of string theory may not be the theory of everything, more like a story of the point particle. This was only the simplest explanation of this theory. If you want to know more about it, check the YouTube video below in the description. Thank you for watching and be ready for other interesting videos. See you later.